So these three voices, this is Randy Travis, Mary, his wife, and Ken, who uh, you guys all work together on this new book that just came out, sitting in front of us here. Uh, mm -hmm. It's Forever and Ever, Amen, a memoir of music, faith, and braving the storms of life. And I'm interested to read this book because what I had heard, and tell me if this is wrong, Randy, you're very open about everything in this. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Are there moments where you guys, even as a couple, had to talk about it? And Ken, you probably sat in on this too, and you go, oh, yeah. should we? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. There were a lot of things we actually wrote and it had to come back and say, you know what? That's true. But maybe we don't need to put that into a book. Yeah. And uh, what are the ones that you went? Yeah, we are going to put it in there. Uh, yeah. There was a lot we did put in. <laughs> yeah, so there's, there's I think people will be surprised yeah. at how honest these guys are in, yeah. in this book. So yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's going to open some eyes. That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah. What made the cut that you thought this is this is one story in particular that we know is going to impact people. They're going to they're going to read it and then they're going to go. This makes me feel something or do something different in my life. Is there a story in there? Oh, yeah. yeah well, I think the hospital story you know, yeah. touches me every time I read it. And, uh, and every time Mary tells it, you, mm -hmm. you tell it best. So well, you go ahead. That's, that, that's just truly a song of hope. I mean, uh, at the hospital and get, going through what this man went through and to survive it with such, with such grace and, and, and kindness. Then the nurses would even say, you know, even, even in, in this state that he's in, which was very bleak, very grim, um, with tubes, you know, everywhere and IVs everywhere. And they said, you know, and his, you know, his skull was off. And, and this is after the stroke? After the stroke. Six years ago? It was six yeah. years ago in July, yes. Wow. But they said, you know, this is one of our favorite rooms to come to because if he's not in his coma, if he's not in a coma, he always smiles and he always says thank you. Yeah. And it's mm -hmm. like, that is just, the, that's just the epitome of this man though. So yeah, that's, you know, and I think that's what we want people to understand is just don't ever give up. Just, yeah. just keep fighting for what you believe, fight for the ones that you love.